Last week, I wrote to the Prime Minister about the scathing report of the UN Special Rapporteur on this government's brutal policies towards the poorest in Britain. As of now, I've received no reply from the Prime Minister. But when the Prime Minister read the report, what shocked her more? Was it the words the UN used, or was it the shocking reality of rising poverty in Britain? Prime Minister! I say to the Right Honourable Gentleman, and we have been clear, as my Right Honourable Friend, Secretary of State for Work and Pensions has been, that we don't agree with this report, because what we actually see... We don't agree with this report. What we actually see in our country today is absolute poverty at record lows. More, pe more people in work than ever before. Youth unemployment almost half. Wages growing. And that's because of the balanced approach that we take to our economy, a Conservative government delivering for the British people. Mr Speaker, it could be that she doesn't agree with it because it's an unpalatable truth that's in that report. The new Work and Pensions Secretary seems to have taken a lesson from her and created a hostile environment for those that are claiming benefits. Yes. One, one of the government's policies that's causing the greatest anxiety and poverty is universal credit. The UN rapporteur, Professor Alston, said it was fast falling into universal discredit. When will the Prime Minister demonstrate some of her professed concern about burning injustices and halt the rollout of universal credit. My Minister! Uh, can I say to the Right Honourable Gentleman, we've exchanged on this issue of universal credit before. Universal no. credit! You, oh, the, the, the Shadow Foreign Secretary from a sedentary position says we've not done anything about it. What we have done, as we have been rolling out universal credit, is making changes as we have gone through those changes. But actually, I'm afraid I'm afraid that what we saw was a Labour Party that wouldn't support the changes we are making to universal credit. So we've listened and we've made changes. It's time actually that the Labour Party recognise that the universal credit is ensuring that we see more people in work in this country, that we see absolute poverty at record lows. And that's it. A system that delivers for people, encourages them into work, a simpler system that's better for those people who need to use it. Jeremy Corbyn.